Hi guys, it's Ellie. Long time no see. I know, and here I am talking to you this time. And please excuse my appearance. I've been having a very painful situation. I have a tooth pain in here since I've gone to the dentist for at least twice. And I also ended up having some medications to heal the pain. Things are going to be just fine. I'm not sick or anything. It's just that tooth pain is making me feel like hell. And I'm really sorry for letting you see me like that. So anyways, let's talk about... What have I been doing around this year? So, so earlier this year, I started doing the Twisted Disney series. Basically, it's Disney princesses, fairies, and a few other characters. They're so pretty, but things just got really dark-sided. And I decided to do some makeup tutorials on that. And so glad to hear that you all enjoyed it. Oh, and right before the aerial makeup tutorial, some of you might have noticed that I changed my hair. I've posted I've posted a blog about about my hair color and and no surprise that I still have red highlights. I was a little tired of having blonde highlights. And the reason why I changed it is because of because of my next tutorial is going to be Ariel from The Little Mermaid. And so I did that. And and after after the hair change a few days later when I was in a relationship, I kind of surprised my boyfriend to, well, since I'm now single, then I have to say ex-boyfriend or last boyfriend, however I want to call it. So, so, okay. Once I've surprised my last boyfriend about my hair changed, he thought he liked it. That's a good thing. And a few moments later, he ended up he ended up getting in a really bad mood. He's been he's been at least drinking or maybe taking a little bit maybe taking drugs or something like that. I'm pretty sure he's not he wasn't a, an addict or anything. But he ended up acting like he lost me. He lost me and he ended up threatening me. And so I ended up broken up I ended up breaking up with him and never saw him for the rest of my life. Now that, now that I'm single, I've gone to bars and mingling to some random guys out there. Okay, and, and what else? Oh yeah, I've also gone traveling to Europe. I've gone to seven countries. And... And two weeks later, I came back home, and I've also posted a blog on on about the trip that I've gone to. I've gone to Germany, I've gone to Austria, I've gone to Italy, I've gone to France, Switzerland, some of the places like that. Yeah, I've posted. I've also posted a blog about that. And showed you a little bit of things from from that from that trip. 
Okay. And also, I'm so glad to hear that some of you might have noticed that that you've liked some of my new singing videos. Especially that one video that's been posted last week, Zombie from the Cranberries. That's one of my favorite and by far my best song for me to sing. And yeah, good thing that I used it. Good thing that I used a different camera because what's bothering is using the webcam it's not so not so attractive you know like hey I'm living at you right now you can hardly tell that I am using a webcam and the sound of the video it was kind of kind of in low standard quality. Yeah. Good thing that I started using I started using my iPad to record to record a couple of videos, a couple of singing videos before I went off to the trip. And I kept on using using the different camera for me to sing a sing whatever song I had in mind to sing and I decided to post it on on YouTube and I've also posted a few videos on my Facebook for those of you who are friends with me on Facebook you get the idea of what, what I've been posting I've been posting singing videos and sometimes I've also posted a few other videos that's that's not me it's some of them are from from the parade and some of them are from someone else's performances and oh yeah I've also done a video of myself being in character and nothing else and that was that was that was on the Halloween time. Okay. So I'm taking a break from doing makeup tour from doing makeup tutorials. The reason why I'm doing this is because it's because I usually end up running out of ideas and what am I supposed to be doing them right now is I don't know I should do something that I'm very passionate to do and I just and I decided to do some singing videos yeah and, and when using my new my new and different camera I'm so glad to hear some positive comments some of you ever enjoyed it and I ended up having this one person requested me to do some more singing some more songs to to sing probably from the same band and also a couple of songs that even though I've already I've already done it but plan on doing plan on doing some improvements to those songs and that is what I'm going to be doing so yeah so glad to hear that some of you enjoyed it oh and by the way anybody have ever noticed different in YouTube okay first of all I changed the name my username is usually my name Ellie with code numbers 3639 
the reason why I I kind of use that name is because for security reasons I really don't want anybody to come haunt me down if I were to use my real name someone's going to someone who I used to know or someone who uh, who knew me that I don't know who it is might want to get really tacky on me and haunt me down I've been avoiding for that kind of situation and Although I kept on refusing to change my username into my real name, I still don't want don't want anybody to hold me down. And so I decided to change change my username into my first name and Yay Cell. That's actually my middle name. And then my last name is is with the letter V as in as in vicious or victory. Kinda common to say V as in vector, but I prefer to to go for something unusual. V as in vicious or V as in victory. Those are the two things that I would have at least said if if I were to to be asked to spell my last name. Okay. And also things in YouTube turned out to be hell. Especially the comments section that's been changed so much. It it gets me really lost on on which which comment is the most top rated comment of all time and which one had the negative votes on those comments and other stuff like that. I love reading the comments though. As much as, as much as seeing thumbs up and thumbs down, yeah, and, and I, and I honestly can't stand why using Google Plus instead of having an inbox in, in YouTube, it's just, it's just brutal. And I honestly can't stand all of those kind of changes that happened a couple years ago. Not so sure if anybody remembers, but a couple of years ago, changes turned out to be hell. Like, what happened to all the all the fun parts when when one of your favorite youtubers post post videos likes videos favorite videos comment on videos and other stuff like that yeah those are the parts that i remember that i remembered that's kind of fun for youtube and another fun part that's fun for YouTube is having friends instead of contacts which is kind of which is kind of impersonal and how would they want it, and how would contacts would want to watch my videos it's it's just not working all right and wow, all the fun stuff for right now, it's it's just it's going down straight to hell. Yeah.
pretty sure there are a lot of computer geeks then that's getting familiar to all all those new things going on and and some and I'm pretty sure some people and some of you are not having fun with Google Plus it's like giving it's like asking you so much information that I especially hate to talk about like one thing I was asked so many so many things about my past relationship specifically so many things about my ex and I can't stand talking talking about it like that and this is this is the one part that this is the one topic that I would never talk about or answer any of those questions it is it's just harsh you know it's like going on a first date and someone who is naive enough to do that ends up ends up having a lot of TMI talking so yeah okay so I know YouTube is not not as fun as it used to be like like a couple years ago and months before right now it's just it's just harsh first and I also didn't like the part that Google Plus is part of this site they also need to change it back or someone who's who's a millionaire or who's or whoever's rich enough to do any computer stuff should make should make a new site yeah someone should make a new site as long as it's fun as it's fun just like Facebook just like YouTube MySpace some maybe Twitter or Tumblr didn't have any of didn't have Twitter or Tumblr because I'm not used to do that I'm not really used to do Twittering or anything like that alright so since I've got since I got some requested songs from from that one person who enjoyed who enjoyed some of my some of my singing videos especially especially zombie from the cranberries I sang that and that was my best song for me to sing and and someone have re had asked me asked me about 90s alternative music I kind of talked about that I I love that kind of I love that kind of genre and I always love listening to that kind of genre from any artist I'm not very picky on I'm not very picky on what's my favorite but I love listening to all bands to all 90s alternative rock bands no matter how awesome they sound so there also be also going to be doing that as well as some um, improving singing videos well singing singing two well, two of them are from the same, from the same artist. It was, and it is Blondie. Heart of Glass and Call Me, gonna do those two. 
this is for this is for an improvement. Since I'm use since I am now using a different camera. And I'm very happy that that I can that I can hear myself in in high quality sound and and I can see myself move myself. And yeah. Okay. I guess this would be it for now, so thanks for watching and I will see you next time.